Your adventure begins now. A unique and amazing experience awaits you 650 feet underground. You'll be traveling into an active salt mine, not far from where miners are harvesting salt to use on icy roads. You will learn about salt, how it's mined, and what it's like to be a salt miner. You can stand next to a superhero or a supervillain among the collection of famous movie costumes on display in the mine. See the dazzling salt crystals on our dark ride, or travel the rails back in time on the Salt Mine Express. Our salt rooms are huge with high ceilings and limitless space. The layers of salt and mud you'll see were formed millions of years ago when this area was completely underwater. Some visitors tell us that breathing the salt there helps people with allergies. The salt in our mine has not been processed like table salt. Please don't lick it. And for your safety, don't pick at the salt walls, even if the salt is loose. Sorry, no smoking, tobacco products, or e-cigarettes are allowed anywhere in our topside or underground facility. Snacks and water can be purchased underground and must be kept in designated areas. To follow mine safety regulations, all visitors are required to wear a hard hat and an emergency respirator while underground and on the hoist, just like the miners do. After this video, we'll take you to the equipment room where you will remove an emergency respirator or self-rescuer and a hard hat from the racks. Place the strap of the self-rescuer over your head and slide one arm through so that it hangs across your body. Adjust the strap so it hangs more comfortably at hip level. Place the hard hat on your head, tightening the knob in the back so it won't fall off when you're looking up at the beautiful salt ceilings. After you're ready, please help your children with their equipment. If the hat is still too big for your child, ask a staff member to provide a chin strap. The self-rescuer weighs about three pounds and is only used if there's a fire or heavy smoke in the area. It converts carbon monoxide into breathable air that is inhaled through a mouthpiece. Our staff will instruct you how to use it in the unlikely case that it is necessary. In the 50 plus years of carrying these, no one has ever had to use a self-rescuer in this mine. Do not open the rescuer or remove it from the pouch unless instructed. Each one will cost over $400 to replace, even dropping it may make it unusable. In case of any emergency while you're underground, a staff member will direct you to the staging area for further instructions or evacuation, or will drive you there on a tram. An announcer on the public address system may ask you to follow the escapeway signs to the staging area located outside the gift shop. If you have any questions or need help at any time, be sure to ask any staff member. We're here to make your adventure as comfortable and fun as possible. So let's get started. You are underground bound.